Okay, detective, what's our next plan of action? We're just going to have to wait for her to make her next move, I'm afraid. She needs Alvis, and we have him. That gives us a little control, and it's very important we have that now, for your daughter's sake. But you heard what Bane said, detective. He said she wouldn't kill my daughters until she destroys the kingdom. Evil little Kelly is unpredictable, your highness, and we know just how fast her plans can change. She will let us know what her demands are soon. We just have to sit tight. Or, it looks like our luck might be just in. Hello, Peter. Do you have another letter for me? Yes, your highness. Here you go. Thank you, Peter. That'll be all. So, your highness, what does she have to say now? The letter says, Dear father, it seems we both have something we want from each other. I guess that gives us something in common after all. The only difference is the lengths I am prepared to go to, to get what I want. And that's the scientist. I'm going to give you one chance to send him here, or I'm going to kill one of your daughters. Don't underestimate me, father, and don't think I won't do it. I will. If the scientist is not in my castle by the end of the night, little Kelly dies. Tick tock, father. Oh my god, detective. What are we going to do? She's going crazy. Oh my god. We have to send Albus, detective. It's the only way to save little Kelly's life. I'll talk to Albus, but I don't think he's going to go along with this, your highness. Okay, Bane, it's time to make a deal. Evil little Kelly is planning on killing little Kelly. We need you to tell us a way of getting into her castle without her knowing. She has the tunnel that we used the last time blocked up. And why should I help you? Because I can reduce your sentence and offer you freedom. I can get you less than half the time the judge will give you. All you have to do is cooperate. Even little Kelly is going to kill the royal family and burn down the magical kingdom. There is nothing you can do, detective, and I won't help you either. Fine, then you will spend the rest of your life rotting in prison. She will get me out when she wins the war, detective. I'm not worried. I'm going to do everything in my power to not let that happen. We won't give up without a fight. Then a fight you shall have, detective. Prepare for war. It's time we took care of the Joker. But I thought we already took care of the Joker. He's still locked in the basement, right, Romulus? Yes, but that's not going to keep him forever. We need him permanently gone. Are you saying we should kill the Joker, Romulus? 
That's exactly what I'm saying, Hegarty. Then we don't ever have to worry about him telling the princess what we did. Okay, that's a good idea. So what do you suggest we do? Shoot him? No. I was thinking that we could blow up the basement. Make it look like an accident. Oh, that's a good idea. And I know just the place we can get some TNT too. And what about Bane Romulus? He's no threat to us, right? No. They'll send him back to Alcatraz. He won't get a chance to speak to the princess. <laughs> We're geniuses, Romulus. This plan worked perfectly. Indeed. Now, Hegarty, show me where that TNT is. Certainly. Follow me. Your Highness, Bane is not prepared to help us. He would rather go back to Alcatraz than give up evil little Kelly. Every villain in the Minecraft world is terrified of her. I don't know how she's doing this. Oh well, Detective, it was worth a shot. We're just going to have to talk to Albus and come up with a plan. Time is ticking, Detective. You heard evil little Kelly. If Albus is not there by the end of the night, little Kelly dies. And I'm not gonna let that happen. Okay, Your Highness, let's hurry. I thought you said there was TNT in here, Hegarty. There was, Romulus. I don't know where it's gone. Oh, wait. I remember now. Remember that time the police stormed the castle and the bomb went off and we thought you and the mad scientist died and then me and evil little Kelly happened to go to Alcatraz because of it? Yes. Well, that's what happened to the TNT. That was the explosion. I remember now. Sorry, this was just a giant big waste of time. Why do you always insist on wasting my time? Sometimes I don't know why I bother with you, Hegarty. You're just a nuisance. Because we're best friends, remember? I wrote us a best friend song, Romulus. Wanna hear it? No! Jeez, fine. Maybe some other time, grumpy pants. <laughs> 